What's up, friends? I'm Sophie Jordan Collins, a 21-year-old LA actress and model. Every week, every couple weeks, I document a little bit of my life. Recently, my life took a little bit of a turn, and I moved to Japan just for a few months. But I've been spending time in the country part of Japan, in Karizawa, experiencing a slower pace of life. I've also been in Tokyo, and let's just let's just take a sneak peek at what this this week consisted of. I have no idea what this brown thing is. Welcome to our cafe. This is Stay tuned, I'll be in Greece next week. Also, weird auditions, photo shoots. I had my first street photo shoot in Tokyo, December 1st. Good morning, friends. I don't know what is up with me lately. Normally, I'm the type of person that can just cash out and like, I have no problem sleeping. But I've had two nights this week where my sleep is just weird like last night i just kept having like this sounds so bad but like a dream of like the dinner that happened that was weird but it was like not good and it kept like waking me up i know that makes no sense but like my stomach was just off we had right here what we ate but I've never had that stuff before. You like cook the meat yourself. So we were eating like beef stomach and like the diet, like meat diaphragm. And I've been trying all of these like new foods since I've been in Japan. I'm a very diverse foodie person. I, yeah, trying this stuff has been fun, but I haven't loved any of the like weird foods that I've tried. Basically like small little portions of meat with like different sauces is kind of what it was so like low down on the dinner casual the client who's interested in me he was super duper chill it was just definitely an odd experience like getting a dinner with them a female colleague of my like agent guy she was there as well so it was like totally fine it was just an interesting situation i think i'll talk about eventually the weather is kind of ishy today which sucks. I found a thing on Meetup, which is an app, and it's basically like Tokyo models and actors, filmmakers collab photo shoot walk tonight that I'm gonna do. I haven't gotten many cool pictures since being here, so. And I think I'm just gonna like use the onsen, go to the gym, and just kind of chill, you know? I keep on getting copyrighted. I just love all the adorable little like street vendors in tokyo it's so crazy to me you'll go from just like super city and then on the next street over it'll just be a ton of like vendors and a temple so now i'm just gonna sing to you i'll sing to you oh yeah i'm going to the photo walk this is the fit for the photo walk I went a little, a little edgier than I normally do. I'm in Nakano, and it's the cutest little like Christmas setup here. It's so cute. I'm a Halloween Halloween Christmas, and in case you didn't hear, you are some really cute animals, including a nude cat. I hope it didn't scare you. Then I went to the arcade, and I played a video game. Then I walked around, then we had a photo shoot. A photo shoot. My musical ability is really shining through. Here's some of the photos. They actually turned out really sick, and I'm quite thrilled. I'm not gonna lie with this shoot. Tokyo is just so cool, it's impossible not to take it because there. It's 6.15, I'm back on my waking up quite early. I woke up at 5.30, but I'm going for a run right now. This is the story of a tall, skinny girl who tried to grow a booty. This is the story of a... Bye, Appa, until we meet again. have all their christmas stuff out it's so cute anyway the hotels here it's so nice they let you leave your luggage for free so out the robot cafe this morning there's a cafe in ginza tokyo and the employees are robots 
but the people operating the robots are employees from home that are disabled. Are you annoyed yet? You sit in silence. Say hi to my video, if I take one. Hello. Hi. Hello. My name is Ono. Welcome to our cafe. It's Onochi. He's a server here at the Avatar Robot Cafe. He works from home and operates this robot. Yes. Isn't that so cool? And his coffee is delicious. Then I headed back to Karizawa. They have gorgeous sunsets. This is the next morning. Journaled, went for a walk, run. And then I got ready for the day. Makeup, hair. And then I did a little self-tape. It's been so funny self-taping there. So I filmed some self-tapes. And now I'm roaming around Karizawa. <laughs> The boonies of Japan, baby. Gorgeous. Bloody hell. All right, here is the creepy country roads. And I took a bus to get my nails done. This is the next day, guys, journaling. I just finished up going for a run, 5K. I just wanted to get some fresh air because today's a little travel day. We're traveling from the country in Sumagoi to Gujo, Japan, because we're gonna be making towels again i don't ask i just go where i'm told so towel making time it's it's still it's still this is with me i'm driving to the train station yeah did i scare you i'm sorry that was the most emotional train ride of my entire life it was also like three hours long we took the shikansen bullet train for like 30 minutes and then we got on an express train to Nagoya, which is another part. Super awesome modeling gig. And then I almost screwed myself over. Stay tuned, I'll be in Greece next week. Good morning guys, it's Thursday. Towel making day. But anyway, I we don't have to be ready until like 10.30, so I'm getting a little workout in. Jimmy, Jim, 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 nature. Ooh, look at these fatties. We don't fish like that in America. And then we did some towel making. So it's at this little gallery place and you just create these cute little towels. You like paint them and then you like blow dry the paint on. These were how ours turned out. We watched the sunset a little bit. We had a yummy Japanese dinner. What this brown thing is. This white stuff couldn't tell you anything about it, but it looks delicious. So. And then after that, we ended up just you know heading back to the hotel. I roamed around a little bit. Thought about going in the Ferris wheel. Didn't. We're making food samples. So like these fake little food thingies. They're so realistic. They almost. Ick me. 